usually for a left-handed person, it's uh, it's the cross shot. Uh, you know, the shield gives the left-handed person an advantage, especially if it's one of the bigger shields. Like I use that tiny little thing right there, so I gotta work more. But most folks use you know, the shields that you see right here. So a lefty can, can get a little bit more of a rest as far as the direct sword play that you get with single sword and Florentine with the with the weapons going uh, going mirror to mirror, you know, mirror fighting. Uh, the a lot of the lefties, at least I know I do, when we're going up against a right-handed person, we will tend to do a cross shot, a fake down, and coming across for this shoulder here from that angle. It's it seems to be universally unexpected, at least Third initially. Shoulder. It's a bread and butter shot for a left-handed person. Uh, uh, some kind of a downwards fake, or maybe even just a pop-up in the air, and going down on the left shoulder of the right-handed person. Because right-handed people aren't expecting someone to go over the shield. That's why the shield is there. And the left-handed person is used to defending that way, and attacking that way. So, as a right-handed person against a left-handed person, it would behoove you to be more cautious with that shield side and maybe even if you once you get enough practice leave that out there as a, as a sucker shot it, you, know, you got to be pretty quick for that one uh, usually it involves putting the shield a little bit closer to your shoulder or uh, being prepared to lean back a little bit to, uh, to offset that shot <coughs> and if you can get the timing right because uh, you know, like I said for lefties it's a lot of lefties it's bread and butter if you if you can get the timing right and get the speed up you can probably catch their arm as they're trying to come in for that cross shot. Or you can, uh, or if you're a right-handed person and they're trying to go for that cross shot, if you can get that shield back, their left side is, uh, or their, uh, yeah, their side is open. They'll try, they'll try they'll to push try to, the board out as yeah, best they can. The yep, but yeah, but they'll try and push the board out, but usually for a left-handed person, when I mean, they're doing that, reaching across for that cross shot, that arm is still up there. It's usually up there. So if and when they reach across, you can either pop across. You're, you know, you're trying to get over their, their sword. And if you can get that shield back and try and get over their weapon and maybe get to their shoulder, you'll be in a much better position for fighting a lefty with a sword and board. So, you know, lefty goes for the cross shot. Lean back, try and go over. Or, you know, if they go for the cross shot, lean back, and try and go back here. If you can get close enough, you can hook it in, and they're toast. Make sense? Yeah. So you're throwing it with your left, right, you're crossing. And they're coming. They're quick enough that they're doing it while I'm throwing. So they're coming in. Well, so give up on this shot. Just go, go back and block. And they'll be like, fuck no. I wouldn't say fuck no. Right, but. Yeah. 
not just doing a chop, a cross chop. You're, you should be putting this out there also. It's almost like uh, uh, it's almost like you're doing an outside shot like this, and you're putting it here. Yeah. Because it puts your hand in a better position to block. Left-handed people fight right-handed. Right-handed people fight left-handed. <laughs> Not at all.